Imagine a world where the clink of a beer bottle is the sound of celebration, history, and elegance. That's the world of Miller High Life, the champagne of beers, celebrating 120 years of brewing excellence. Welcome to Crazy for Beer, a channel that is all about beer. In this video we cover, Miller High Life celebrates 120 years fun facts. In 1903, Miller Brewing Company introduced Miller High Life, setting a new standard in American brewing. It wasn't just a beer, it was an experience, served in a clear, champagne-style bottle. This was a drink meant not for the taverns, but for the finest tables, enhancing the dining experience with its unique taste and elegance. The Girl in the Moon, an iconic emblem of Miller High Life since 1906, remains shrouded in mystery. Was she a vision of an advertising executive lost in the woods, or a figure from a Miller family artwork? Her origins might be unknown, but her presence is unmistakable, sitting gracefully on a crescent moon inviting us to join her in a toast to the high life. Remarkably, Miller High Life thrived even during Prohibition, a testament to its enduring appeal. While other breweries faltered, Miller adapted, selling High Life as a non-alcoholic cereal beverage, yet keeping its iconic packaging and the girl in the moon. This resilience ensured a seamless transition back to a beloved alcoholic brew post-Prohibition. Post-World War II saw a surge in Miller High Life's popularity. GIs returning from overseas developed a taste for it, leading to an unprecedented demand. The brewery even had to ration supplies, a clear sign of the beer's growing popularity. High Life wasn't just a beer, it became a symbol of American joy and camaraderie. Another symbol of Miller High Life is the Soft Cross, a modern evolution of the historic Criss Cross label that adorns the neck of the bottle. This logo, introduced in 1954, is now a defining image of Miller, visible for miles above the Milwaukee Brewery. The term Miller Time might remind you of Miller Lite, but it actually originated with High Life. Launched in the 1970s to reinvigorate the brand, this campaign captured the essence of relaxation and good times, becoming a cultural phenomenon and driving High Life to new heights of popularity. Today, Miller High Life stands not only as a testament to the brewery's history but also as a celebration of life's simple pleasures. It's a blend of tradition and joy using the same yeast strain Frederick Miller brought over in the 1850s. This continuity is a rarity, a bridge between past and present. As we raise a glass to 120 years of Miller High Life, we wonder, what's your favorite Miller High Life memory? Let us know in the comments. If you are crazy for beer, be sure to check out the links in the description for our line of beer merch and other beer-related stuff.